Good morning, church. It is Christmas Eve, and we are coming to you from Rick and Janet's Lake House. We hope you enjoy this. Welcome, Welcome home. home.
Augustus issued a decree that a census should be t taken of the entire Roman world. This was the first quintus that took place while Quirinius was governor of Syria. And everyone went to their own town to register, to register. So Joseph also went up from the town of Nazareth in Galilee to Judah to Bethlehem the town of David because he belonged to the house and line of David. He went there to register, register with Mary who was pleaded to be married to him and was expecting a child. While they were while they were there at the time came for the baby to be born, and she gave birth to her firstborn, a son. She wrapped him in cl cloths and placed him in a manger, because there were no guest room available for them, and there were shepherds living out in the fields nearby, keeping watch over their flocks at night. An angel of the Lord appeared to them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them, and they were terrified. But the angel said to them, Do not be afraid. I bring you good news that will cause great joy for all the people. Today in the town of David, a Savior has been born to you. He is the Messiah, the Lord. This will be a sign to you. You will find a baby wrapped in clothes and lying in a manger. Suddenly a great company of the heavenly hosts appeared with an angel praising God and saying glory of the God, glory to the God in the highest heaven on earth peace to those whom his favor rests when the angels had left them and gone to, into heaven the shepherds said to one another let's go to bethlehem and see the thing that has happened which the lord has told us about so they hurried off and found Mary and Joseph and the baby who was lying in the manger when they had seen him. They spread the, wor the word concerning what had been told them about this child. And all who heard it were amazed and what happened shepherds to them. But Mary treasured up all of these things and pondered them in her heart. The shepherds returned glorifying and praising God for all the things had been heard and seen, which were just as they had been told. Merry Christmas, church family. We hope you have a very blessed holiday season. We love you guys so much, and we will see you in January during 21 days of prayer and fasting. And we believe that God has more in 2024. Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas.